welcome to my channel this is Claire I'm so glad to have you here so today's video I'm showing you how we're able to make different projects uh, we're able to make uh, two stools and a simple table uh, all the material will be linked in the description box below um, and if you're new here just please don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification bell so that you're notified every time that I upload thank you all so much so let's get to it we're starting off with this bucket that we got from Walmart. The base for this is 15.5 inches. And then we got this concrete from our Home Depot. So we lined uh, the bucket with some oil and then just uh, started adding concrete with water to make the paste that we really wanted. After it was all settled, um, we removed all the air bubbles and then just um, made sure that it's all lined up. And now we added uh, these dowels that we got from Home Depot as well. Um, the diameter for this is one inch. So we just cut them into two and these are the ones we shall be using for the legs. We taped them so that they can keep in place as they dried. Um, so we put that aside and also made a smaller one. And um, this will be uh, making the small seat for our baby as well. We left them out to dry um, for almost five hours and then we just took them out of the buckets and also let them air dry for overnight. So this is how that piece looks like after the five hours and I think it was really, really beautiful already. But we let it out to dry um, more overnight and it turned out so much better as you can see. And now we're just sanding it up and removing all the excess uh, cement and cleaning it up. As you all can see, these edges look much better and the piece looks much neater. Um, so if you want, you can stop at this point. Um, but uh, we decided to make three pieces of these. Uh, what, two of them will be the stools and one will be uh, a table. And now uh, we spray painted all these legs with gold and this paint we got also from Home Depot. We will start with the table, um, so the cement part we shall just paint it black and then we shall add um, some more designs onto it. We literally use trash bags to cover the other areas that we didn't want uh, the paint to go to. Um, and this is how this table already is looking. I think it's really nice. Uh, we just left this aside and worked on the flowers. And now I use the plaster to uh, model these flowers. All you have to do here is to just mix plaster with water, make a paste, and then pour it onto the molding plate. Now this cup totally messed me up, I'm sorry for the mess, uh, but when it dries it will really uh, come out um, exactly as we need it. I tried to clean it but it's not easy so I just took it outside, dried it up the way it was and then um, just removed the excess once uh, the flowers were dry. So back to our table, um, once the flowers were dried, I spray painted them with gold and this is how they look like. And uh, so we shall just be using E6000 and hot glue to glue them onto um, the top of um, this table.
After the flowers were in place, we just added this 12 inch mirror that we got from uh, Michael's and just glued it down using E6000 and left it out to dry for uh, like three hours. I think this simple table is really, really cute. I love the gold and the black. Um, it just looks so amazing. It turned out so well and the flowers really didn't come off. So I was glad about that. For the second piece, we shall be making a stool. Um, so we use this spray adhesive to attach foam onto um, this cement. Now we use the spray adhesive for this and the foam I already had it from another project that we had done before. So we just pieced around the different pieces that we had uh, to make a really nice round shape. We then added polyfill. Uh, we already had this from our old project. That's the Ottoman. In case you've not watched it, I'll link it in the description box below. Uh, so we use the spray adhesive as well to just attach all these pieces onto the cement before we added our fabric. This is the fabric that we shall be using. We got this from Joann's. We really loved it, so we decided to go with it. Um, we took this entire piece inside and we shall be stapling this fabric onto the doors just to make sure it's all intact because it's really hard to staple the cement. These pieces turned out so well. I'm just so glad um, how they came out and uh, they're really gorgeous. Um, I will just put it in the corner of my house and it will decorate my space. But um, my baby also has a seat, so that's really nice. Let me know in the comments um, how you feel about these pieces and your favorite. I'd really be glad to hear from you. I really hope you loved this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and also share this video with your family and friends. Subscribe and turn the notification bell so that you're notified every time that I upload. Um, I have other videos as well in my description box that you can check out for DIYs, decors and crafts. Thank you all so, so much for your support and I'll see you next time. Bye.